Hi, I'm Paul Westaway. Um, I'm a partner in Melview Farming with my wife here, Kirsty. You're in Dimmock in Gloucestershire. Um, we farm about 195 acres. This is a Gloucestershire County Council farm. Um, about two thirds of the farm is in countryside stewardship. The other third we, we farm conventionally. Um, we have about 150 pedigree animals here, mainly Aberdeen Anguses and uh, Murray Greys. So it's all about calving ease, low birth weight, uh, the correlation between dead calves and growth is not very good so we use as much easy calving as we can beef from grass because it's a dry farm we've always been into legumes here so we've grown lucerne for years um, we're just putting our first herbal lays in this spring um, so really getting the business ready for for the challenge that are ahead behind me is one of our splendid dung heaps and um, this used to be a bit of a pain in the ass in some ways and what, what are you going to do with it now this is absolutely gold dust. This will get moved, becomes compost. We'll soil test every uh, field in this block. We'll work out which field needs what. Most prized asset on the farm, we look after it, we love it. Don't need fertilizer here anymore um, as long as we manage this stuff properly. The easiest way to improve um, sustainability of cattle is to make them more efficient. So everything here calves at two years old. Um, we're measuring what's performance. You see the animals for five years, we have a full EID system. Every animal gets measured every month, so we know what they weigh. We're tracking growth. Um, the older cows all have monitoring tags in, um, so we're, we're tracking eating, we're tracking rumination, we're tracking overall health, um, and we're using all that technology to make them more efficient. So we're using the best genetics from around the world. We're doing a quite a big ET program here, so multiplying our best females. So hence the Herefords you can see in this group are actually carrying embryos. Um, and we're using every bit of science we can um, to make the cows more sustainable. I'm really looking forward to the Innovation um, for Agriculture Farmer of the Future conference at Harper Adams. This is a journey, you know, UK agriculture is going to go through its biggest change since World War II. We need to um, hit all our, our targets that the industry has set. We also need to make sure there's enough good food for our customers to eat. And we also need to make sure that our businesses are profitable. And I do truly believe that all three are possible. So we're really looking forward to April the 13th at Harper Adams. Um, I look forward to seeing some old and new friends there.